been almost two years since Tesla released Autopilot Hardware 2 for its vehicles. And although it started kinda rough, after a series of updates, it's gotten pretty good. But through those changes over the years, one thing has remained consistent, and that is whether or not Hardware 2 has surpassed Hardware 1 in terms of performance, and whether Hardware 1 is even going to see updates at all in the future. Hardware 2 owners brag about how beautifully Autopilot handles the crests of hills while Autopilot 1 veers across the line to the side of the road. Hardware 1 owners say, well, at least our vehicle can lane change whenever it wants and not in designated areas, and our vehicle can actually read the speed limit sign instead of using GPS data. Although I would argue that this feature is awesome, it does have its downsides. But all kidding aside, I don't think Autopilot 1 is done getting updates yet. In fact, I believe that some of the cool features that Elon tweets about that are coming will also come to Hardware 1 in some version or another. Take Auto Lane Change for example. I've definitely noticed in my Hardware 1 vehicle the ultrasonics are detecting vehicles much further back in the lane than they have ever done in the past. I think this will definitely lead to some sort of blind spot detection or monitoring and with the drive on nav feature where it tells you which lane to be in and auto changes lanes, Hardware One might do something such as letting you know when it's safe to change lanes so that you can be in the proper lane for your exit coming up ahead. And speaking of drive on nav and exits, the way that Elon explains it it's that you will get to the exit with autopilot, then take over as you navigate the curve off of the exit, and then autopilot will automatically re-engage whenever you get to the next freeway. This particular feature, I would not be surprised if Hardware 1 was more than capable of doing, considering that right now Hardware 1 can navigate some pretty tight turns. And it still seems with every update that there are little things that get added that lead me to believe that Autopilot 1 just isn't done being updated yet. That's what I think. How about all of you? Is Autopilot 1 going to come out of beta after this next update and be the final version and never get updated again? Or will Hardware 1 and Hardware 2 get little updates along the way, but all of the big major stuff gets saved for the full self-driving suite? I'm interested in having a discussion on this, so feel free to leave your comments and questions in the comment section below. And as always, thanks for watching.